All right, here we go. Stage seven. This is the only one with a seventh stage, I believe. Uh, all right, this looks similar. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. All right, this is fine. Oh! Ah, it tried to- Oh, it tried to- Ooh, ooh. Well, I missed the shield. That shield is gone, and so are my good bullets. What in the heck is that? <laughs> what in the heckity heck is that? What's all that trash? Okay. We're fine. I'm gonna- I'm gonna slow down. I think we're just gonna, like, constantly slow down. Because if I can do that, then it seems like everything just falls down in front of me. Which is nice! That works! Alright, oh, 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 oh! Yes. Let's... I suppose I can try to take you guys out. Oh, I can't. Nope, I can't, I can't, I can't. Oh, God. Man, guys, this game is, uh... This game is definitely something else that I was not expecting. I, I really was not expecting it to take quite a turn, you know? Oh, I want that! Please. Please, thank you. Excellent. Mm-hmm. Alright, I took all of that, but I mean, the shield did its job. The shield definitely did its job. Okay, I can't rely on shooting these to death because they have quite a bit of health. I might have been able to if I kept the, uh, the ball shot, but that is definitely not the case. Yo, Peppy, I'm busy. I'm so busy just trying to stay alive right now, my dude. I can't save your butt every single time. I will try. There we go. I saved you! Stop ouching! I'm also ouching. Does anyone care about how I feel right- Oh, shoot! That was quite the ouch. Alright, we're gonna do that that way. That that way. Uh. Yep, there we go. Uh, that way. That way. Excellent. Okay. Yes. That way. Huh, that way. Yes! Whew! Excellent. Croak, help me. Okay, I got you. I have a feeling if I stayed in these, then I probably would have gotten something kind of interesting, but it's okay. It's okay. Everything is scary. Okay. Man, this is intense. I have four bombs, which I will gladly abuse later. Oh, I'm slowing down. I'm slowing down. Can I fit through there? Oh, I can fit through there. Oh, okay. Oh, Falco went down. Oh, God. Falco's the first one down. Well, I'm sorry, but I'm having a crisis right now. Yeah, that's what I figured. The break is coming in such huge handy uh, on this stage. <laughs> um, I'm getting very well acquainted with that B button. Oh, another boss. All right. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. 
What's that? What do I shoot? I shoot base? I shoot base. At least I can actually hit this thing. That's nice. So he has cannons for arms and a base that shoots missiles. Now he's doing something wacky. Cool. Oh. Nope. Okay. Oh, you're just gonna keep doing that, huh? Well, I can also do bombs. Oh, I don't think it actually reached him. I think it actually hit one of his things, one of his cannonballs, and then it was like, mm, no. I kind of want to keep the rest of my bombs for, you know, the rest of Venom. All right, where's that going? Oh, excellent. That came from off screen. That's my favorite. Oh, another health bar? Okay. Oh, I don't know what to do. Wait, is this the same thing that we just fought? I think it is, just not shipified. Oh, God. What am I shooting at? I think I'm shooting at his base. Oh, excellent. Woo! Woo! That was scary. That was extremely scary. You know what else is scary? This, considering uh, I have zero lives right now. Health, 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 one up, one up, health, one up, health, please. Your father was a reckless fighter too. Well, my friend, not friend. Aw. Uh, oh, you don't know the meaning of reckless till you go through these. Oh my god. I'm about to die. Cool, I have, uh, no health. This will be McCloud's last battle. Oh, you bet it will be. You bet it will be. <laughs> okay. Uh. Okay. I have to like literally not take damage here. That. That's not great. <laughs> I have to play it super safe. Oh, there it is. There's that damage I didn't need it to not take. Woof. But hey, you know what? Actually, this might be okay because I believe we have a credit. I do believe we have a credit, which means we might start over at... Uh, we may just start over at stage seven. <sighs> it's stage six. Oh, it's stage six, isn't it? Yep, I start from literally ah uh, the beginning. Oh, I love that. Uh, oh no, it starts me over at stage seven. Excellent, excellent. Okay, you know what? That works, that works. Okay, I'm basically in, like, the best possible position that I can be in for this. <laughs> okay, I've made it through everything. I have two lives. I have almost all of my shield, which I'll, uh, replenish in here. Uh, I have my balls, and I have four bombs. I could have five, but I have four. Um, now I just need to focus on literally not getting hit. Okay. Which, you know is easier said than done because of all this garbage okay it's okay it's okay okay i'm half down that's a lot better than last time 
This is all. This this is a very good position, actually. And uh, I get to spam my bombs on him. I'm not sure if I should spam it on the face or if I should spam it on on you know the next part. Maybe I'll do a little bit on the face here after he you know spits up. I'm gonna do that. Heck yeah, take that out. Oh wait, 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 wait! Oh 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 oh! Yeah, there we go, there we go. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. I need to not. I've been spamming break this entire like past venom. This entire stage, I was spamming break, but now I should probably uh, only use break when I really need it. Like, right now. Okay, I'm gonna dodge a little bit. I'm gonna dodge a little bit. Bomb. Okay. Yeah, I feel like he definitely has a whole lot more health than he had before. Dodging. Okay. Oh man, this is taking a while. It's definitely taking a while to expose the core again. Excellent. Hit break. He only has one eye left. I'll just immediately spam bombs on the core. All right, here we go. Bomb. Another, uh, actually, uh, yep, that works. Come on, dude. Come on, dude, go down. Nope, I have to go through another, uh, another cycle. Oh, what? Ooh, this is new. Oh, this is new. Now I have to start doing this garbage. Okay, just move back and forth. Kind of in a circle. While kind of aiming in the general direction of his eyes. Hmm. No, oh, I thought I got I, I thought I got tagged by that. Okay, one eye down. One more. This is tiring. Ooh, all right, cool, 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 cool. Now just spam, spam, spam it, spam it, spam it, spam it. Is he dead? Oh my God, he's dead. Holy crap, please tell me that's it. <laughs> Please tell me that's it. Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Please be it. Please be it. I'm done. I'm done. I, I've been here for almost two hours trying to get to this point. Um, I'm done. Oh, thank goodness gracious, we are done. Whew! That was brutal. Oh. Thanks, guys! <laughs> And there they go. A job well done. Oh, 
I'm waiting to see what's different. What's different? Oh, okay. So it's, it's bringing me to this. I thought they were going to do like, this is Corneria, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So uh, clearly my percentages are going to be a little bit different because I did use save states to, you know, survive. So uh, this these numbers might not reflect what was actually in the episode, but this is what we're ending up with. And holy crap. Man, this is brutal. Total score. 60,000. I'm good with that. I'm good with it. You know what? I'm satisfied with that. Come in, Cornelia. This is Cornelia. Pepper speaking. Congratulations on a job well done. That's it? No special ending? Oh, I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed. There's no special ending for beating stage three. Ah! <laughs> All right, you know what? It's fine. It's whatever. Uh, I feel accomplished that I could even beat it at all because this... Man, I knew it was going to be difficult, but I was not expecting level three to be as absolutely brutal as it was. Um... A lot of it was fair. I feel like a lot of it was just, you know, it boiled down to, hey, get good scrub, uh, and th and sentiments along those lines. But there were there were definitely a couple of times that felt like artificial difficulty. You know, when it goes past the point of like I'm I could be playing better, and it kind of goes into you have to play perfect to be able to actually progress. Slash, how were you supposed to know that you were going to get hit by that unless you already knew in advance that it was going to come at you? You know, things like that. Uh, specifically, Sector Z was horrendous. It was absolutely horrendous. I hated it. I cannot. I never want to see that stage again, ever, whatsoever. We're done. I, I would prefer not to. I'd prefer not to. <laughs> Goodness gracious, it's so bad. Anyway, um, if you are able to clear this game, uh, level one, level two, level three, without using save states, you know how ye old school had to do it on the Super Nintendo. If you're able to do that, man, kudos to you. Absolutely kudos to you because, uh, this game definitely uh, takes some heavy, heavy swings when it comes to the difficulty ramp. And I I don't know, you would have to play through it so many times to be able to uh, clear it and figure out the strategies. Uh, I noticed the patterns because I was able to, you know, go into, I was, I was able to like save state and go back and then immediately try again. And I was like, Oh, I have to break here, or oh, it comes flying at me at this point, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, and I feel like, of course, that allowed me to learn the stages better than I would have otherwise. Um, but if I didn't have that, I would have I would have to play through the entire game just to get another what two or three shots, <laughs> depending on how many credits you had or how many how many lives you had left over. I don't know it. it, it I imagine playing this game without save states and I just, I just want to cry. <laughs> like I said, I'm up to two hours recording this, this, uh, in this re recording right now. And that was with save states. Um, it, and it is just, it is, uh, brutal. It's brutal. Uh, I, and mad respect, mad respect if you can clear this without them without those save states. But otherwise, this is a technical marvel. Imagining this game coming out uh, coming out on the SNES and doing all of this 
is unreal. I can I, I I can imagine playing this game over and over and over because I did. When I was a kid, I did play this game so many times. I don't know if I ever beat level three because a lot of that specific route felt uh, felt new and I didn't know what was coming up or what to expect. Whereas most of the other stuff felt, you know, at least familiar and I, I could kind of get a sense for what was coming up or what, what might happen. But all of level three, I couldn't, I, I did not remember any of it. So, um, yeah, it was interesting. It was interesting going through it as an adult and thinking about, and thinking about, man, the perspective that people had back when this first released, uh, a 3D chip on the, <laughs> on the Super Nintendo is no joke. And honestly, even though the frame rate is absolute garbage, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good for what was what it was capable of uh, at the time, and the fact that it is even playable is a marvel in itself. Um, I I feel like a lot of the polygon the poly, the polygonal uh, nature of the enemies and the areas almost worked in its favor because it feels very. Uh, it feels very memorable and it feels unique. And of course, the soundtrack of this game is honestly really good. It's really, really good. I enjoyed hearing the songs again. It brought back a lot of nostalgia. Uh, a lot of the songs are iconic, which I mean, and like I said about the sound design and the sound effects in general, a lot of those sounds, I hear them and I immediately think, Star Fox, <laughs> which is a very important note for any any game to have, you know? So um, I, I might have complained here and there about this game and about how dumb it is, but uh, do you know that I had it with a blanket of respect and a blanket of being impressed of what this game has to offer in the time frame that it offered it. It is unreal. And now I do believe if we stay on this the end screen, we will hear something nifty. So we're going to wait just a moment. It's a little jingle. That's actually really neat. So I read about this, uh, but I'd never seen it myself. So this is kind of a treat for me too. Uh, I could actually see that being a really good, like, either a ringtone or a notification sound. It, it's, it's very pleasant. It's nice and soft and kind of warm. I like that. What a neat little Easter egg. And speaking of Easter eggs, that's not the only one, but I think we're going to make that its own episode because I'm in pain. This, this was a, <laughs> this episode was a lot. So, um, we're going to hold off on seeing what, uh, Easter eggs there are. There are two hidden, there are two hidden, um, worlds, not worlds, but stages, I guess you could say. Kind of, kind of two hidden stages. Um, but we're gonna take a look at what those are next time. It might be a shorter episode, but we shall see. Uh, thank you so much for watching. This was a wonderful series. We only have one more video to go that might just be a very, very short, uh, nod to the hidden things in this game. But, uh, with that, we are done with Star Fox for the SNES. And what a, what a fun, what a fun nostalgia blast this was. I had fun. I enjoyed this a lot. So, uh, I will see you all later. Bye-bye. Miss Sayanella, out.